journey to Kadua. We've literally just been thrown off the bar by the side of the road. They kind of know where you want to go and then just go, Hikadua! And then you just have to run and by the time you've got to the front of the bus he's already chucked your bags out and they're already driving off before you're even off the bus. Today Sophie's taking control of direction so we could end up back in Marissa. <laughs> I don't ever want it to give up. Just checked in, bit of a grubby bathroom, so after a couple of attempts to get it fully clean, we are now heading out to the beach with the GoPro, where apparently there's a turtle beach, so... I've got a feeling there's going to be a turtle over here because there's huge look. Oh, they're all trying to. Sh oh, I don't like that. I'm trying to touch it. Leave it alone. People are just playing stupid or uneducated, but I, t I had to tell a kid off like holding onto its shell and like That's letting it drag, drag him along. It's like it's a big sign there yeah. saying it's illegal to touch them, so I don't know. I feel like there needs to be someone there maybe monitoring it. Derailed and 1,200 people were on board, and only 10 people survived, including a two year old girl. This is another museum which is right next door to the other, the first one we went to. Just as sad, you can watch a video at the end on like different clips of, of the tsunami, and there's photos of the lady's niece everywhere who died. and this used to be a uh, uh, mother-in-law's house. Um, it is eye-opening. This is the memorial for the tsunami where 2,000 dead bodies are buried. This statue is another memorial to the tsunami which was gifted by the Japanese. And I think the statue is as high as the wave was. About 15 metres.
today we've decided to run out a couple of snorkels, get a little bit further off the beach. How much better is it? Yeah, it's better. <laughs> oh my god. Sophie keeps stubbing her toe on a reef, killing it, no doubt. And also, I've just spotted what I think is a black tip reef shark. fish that look like small sharks. <laughs> they were sharks. <laughs> and now we're gonna drop the cameras back, um, go get showered, go for something to eat and then enjoy New Year's Eve. We're not gonna take the cameras out because we're gonna, we're gonna have a few drinks. Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Inside a fort, I thought I don't know what a fort it was really. I just thought it was like a yeah. So we're basically in Chester. Rain. <laughs> Thoughts on golf so far? I love it. It's really nice, isn't it? Very western, but very European. That's not why I love it, but it's nice. There's loads of stuff to see. I think. This is the first breadfruit tree planted in Sri Lanka. I don't even know what a breadfruit is. <laughs> 15 rupees for an ice cream. How much is that? 5p each? Yeah. Off your trot. <laughs> careful, careful. Don't, don't. It's really windy. Careful. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Quick, oh, careful. <laughs> <laughs> get dressed up and hire photographers for your photo in front of the clock tower. That's rule number one. You know something about the clock, so?
five o'clock here. Yeah. Disneyland Paris or something. Yeah. You've got those little villages which are completely made up. Yeah. It's like that just because it feels like it just doesn't belong in Sri Lanka. It's beautiful though. Sunset, grab a little bit of something to eat, and then probably jump on a bus or a train back to Hikadua. Snake charmer. Snake charmer. <laughs> yeah. We are sat on the west wall of the fort. Lamin, lovely. India, here we come. And the easiest way to get to the train station is to go by the train. Obviously. So, how do you pronounce Hikadua? <laughs> Not Hikadua. Hikadua, they understand you if you say Hikadua, they understand <laughs> station called airport can't see the airport and the bus guy didn't charge us the whole way so when we got off it was like how much do we owe which was a bit strange and then he said a hundred and then said and a hundred each for the bags that's never happened before so I think he was trying to mug us off so we uh, told him no and he said okay <laughs> 